Hey butterflies, welcome back to my channel. My heart just feels so, so full saying that. I always miss you guys. I have recorded so many videos and just not posted them just because I wasn't like super passionate about it and I've always said I don't wanna just post a video just to post it. So today I'm actually doing something that you guys always love when I post and of course I love it too, is I'm bringing you guys another go to lip combos video. Now it took me a while for this because I'm not gonna lie to you guys, finding lip products are hard. Like I felt like I had pretty much found all the products that were at least affordable. So in this video I might have some like non-affordable but not super high-end products. They're just hard you guys. This is getting real hard out here in these streets to find lip products. I might just like really focus on like lip glosses and lipsticks because lip liners it's getting the pressure is getting worse. Let's just get into the lip combos. I'm super excited. I don't know how many I'm going to show you guys. I just put all the products in front of me right now and we're going to get into them. I am so excited right now. I I say this every single time but YouTube really is my baby. My baby like I will always come back to this because this is really what I want to do, truly. By the way, my go-to lip product when I don't, like right now what I'm wearing that isn't a lip combo, I'm wearing Too Faced lip injections. They sent me so many different kinds. It's like my go-to because it just plumps my lip. Like for instance, while I'm getting ready. I would say I'm not going in any particular order, but I definitely am. I want to start this off by showing like my go-to lip combo right now. What I wear in 90% of my looks when I'm not doing a lip combo video or just not trying out a new product or whatever. I feel like it goes with every single look that I wear. So I'm going to show you guys my favorite lip liner at the moment. It's not drugstore, I'm so sorry. But it's so nice. I bought it a while ago and I literally pick it up every single time I go to do a lip combo. It's like just what I naturally gravitate towards. And it's Makeup by Mario. Let me just sharpen it. It's Makeup by Mario and he's just like, he has some really, really great products. And I did not expect to like his lip liners. I was in Sephora and I was looking for like some brown liners just to try because like I said, I'm just always on the hunt. And I got this one, it's in the shade Jeff. There's just something about this lip liner that just speaks to my entire spirit. So I'm gonna try it on for you guys. <laughs> it's just so creamy like, it's creamy, the color is beautiful. The brown is like a really nice brown too. It makes like putting on liner so much easier when the liner is creamy, when it's pigmented so you don't have to keep going over it. It just does all of that for you. So then that's pretty much it. That's how I would line it. I do overline a tad bit. But like I've said in previous videos, if you want your like lips to look really pouty, just overline like right here in the middle down there. It helps a lot. That is Makeup by Mario in the color Jeff. Chef's Kiss is what he needs to call it. Now my go-to lip is kind of drug story. I mean, it's sold at Ulta, so I feel like if you could find something at Ulta, that's a good sign. So it is the Juvia's Place gloss in Barely There. I actually got sent this by Juvia's Place, and I was like, this is gonna be way too light. Like, that's just what I thought, and it is so pigmented and so pretty. First of all, beautiful. And I just love, like, when I told you guys that something is too light for you, just darken the lip liner. I absolutely love that hack. Like, the fact that I can really pull this off. While I have this on, you guys know how I mush them together until it blends out. The good thing about the Makeup by Mario pencil is that on the other end, I don't know if you guys noticed that it was double-ended. Um, I think both sides are supposed to be black. This is not the right lid. <laughs> on this end, there's a little brush that you use to basically blend out your, your lip combo. So I feel like it's like perfect for things like this because it just makes the whole process a lot easier. There's the first one, you guys, this is literally my go-to. I cannot express how much I wear this combo right here. Like it just goes with everything. I feel like it's neutral enough where like you could wear this with orange eyeshadow, blue eyeshadow. It'll just basically eat every single time. So I'm going to zoom you guys in. I love to zoom you guys in and just show you like, look at that. It gives... And like I always say, that ombre effect is always going to make your lips look poutier. And I love that. Giving. Okay, so I have another Juvia's Place one that I like. It's a lot darker, but it'll be nicer for like deeper tones or if like you just want a straight nude. It's called Caramel Rose. You want to see it next to the one that I'm wearing. So this one right here is barely there. The one that I'm wearing, this one's a lot deeper, but it's very, very neutral. I like this one too, but it is darker. Like, let me just swatch them for you. There's barely there. It's very like on the pink side. There, that's a big difference and this is Caramel Rose. But it's so pretty on and like 
even you can see right here that like you can really play with the color so i don't know i've tried it i've used it and i think one of my lip combos on my tiktok if i'm not mistaken color is really pretty i love the formulation of those glosses i definitely want to buy more they have a lot like i'd go there i go to ulta all the time and they'd always be sold out of their lip products but i went to get that darker one after i tried this lighter one and they had like everything in stock so now i just want to go back and grab all of them because the formulation is just so nice it's not sticky it lasts i love that you can just blend it and blend it and it just it doesn't get thick it doesn't get cakey sticky nothing my lips are definitely gonna go through it through this video because in between i'm just scrubbing the lip product off my next liner that i really have been liking is from rem beauty i love this packaging i like keep most of her lip products in here i'm gonna say i love her lip oils for like you know at night during the day this one right here is my favorite this is raspberry drip i like keep it on my vanity because i'm always applying this when my lips are just dry and it's also my favorite thing to put on before bed if i'm not wearing my laneige lip mask which is also top tier okay i definitely just grabbed the wrong liner and i was about to put it on lyrics is a pink a dark pink nude the one that i like looks more beat up that looks more like it it's called reverb so this is reverb it's pretty dark i can't tell if it's darker than jeff i don't know i'll have to swatch them okay so they're very very similar but i definitely think reverb is a bit darker it's this one right here and then i'm gonna pair it actually with a lip product that i got that really surprised me i don't know why i did because it was viral on tiktok and most of the time i know there's a lot of people who like to hate and say that people lie like they just hype stuff up but most of the time honestly when i try something that was famous off of tiktok or viral or trending or whatever it doesn't disappoint me so this didn't either this is a tarte maracuja juicy lip plump and these are always sold out they're a pretty interesting contraption you gotta like pump it like a pen and it is a gloss it does have a lot of pigment though and i'm gonna use the shade primrose and it's just really really like juicy like the pigment is crazy so like you gotta kind of be gentle with it and see i'm still using my makeup by mario and there's that this is a lot vampier than the last and i like i have this conversation with myself all the time do i prefer a vampy dark lip combo or like a nude lip combo and i genuinely think i like vampy because whenever i put on vampy i am feeling myself like with the nude i feel so like cute and like girly and like all that stuff really feminine but with vampy i just feel like i give like grown woman like sultry you know like they give off two completely different energies and i think i like the vampy one more because i just like feel so good so again you're zoomed in and i just love this just look at it you guys this color is gore just i don't want to take it off but we got to keep this going i found the lid to my makeup by mario so yeah it should be double ended like that i love this thing i love it i'm gonna try to talk a little bit less because my lips they're tired okay, so we're gonna use jeff again because jeff is realistically my everyday liner so okay so for the next gloss it's actually one that caught me by surprise and it did really good on tiktok in one of my lip combo videos which i'm not surprised about because it's just such a surprisingly pretty color elf is this a plump yeah it's a plumping gloss but to me it doesn't give like a tingly feeling and it's in mocha twist it like gives also like it's not nude at all it's not like pink at all it's like a it's like peachy it's like a dark peach but it's really pretty there it is really pretty it also gives like vampy i'm gonna turn down this light just a little bit so you guys can see like in real time it's like pretty dark but it's really pretty very pretty Let's go ahead and get straight to the next lip combo we're on to the fourth lip product if you want to know what lip liner i'm wearing take a guess you know when i first tried this first of all i love all nyx products but when i first tried this gloss years ago like i think i was like i don't know 18 or 19 right which is crazy to think that that was like six seven years ago Whew, i hated it but also back then i didn't wear lip liners so imagine me putting this color on with no lip liner just thinking it was gonna be you know peaches and cream so now that i've discovered lip liner okay so we're gonna do fortune cookie this is fortune cookie you guys and it's very very light like it's like the juvia's place one i use but a lot thinner i like that it's not so pigmented it makes it easier to build if you don't want it to be super bright well my mom would buy me like those kid makeup sets growing up and they would always have that barbie pink in it that just looked crazy on anybody that's how this looked on me here it is very cute very on the pinky side and i feel like you wouldn't think i mean it could depend on the liner that you use but like looking at it 
it gives like peach kind of but on your lips it's like it's pink feminine cute one of those it's in that category and i really like it i love this one um i wear this one usually with like really simple eye looks really like like if the eye look isn't super extravagant super colorful super creative i'll wear something like this or like now when i'm not wearing eyeshadow i purposely didn't wear eyeshadow because i wanted the focus to be on the lips but on like days like this this look is like perfect voila so so freaking cute like you can't tell me this isn't like so beautiful this is another one of those ones i think will look cute on anybody like if you have the fairest of skin obviously wear a nude liner and if you have the deepest of skin wear a dark brown and it's gonna look oh my god any of y'all would eat this would eat this color up fortune cookie i really underestimated you but now that i have you like i'm not gonna let go i promise if you made it this far congrats you might have just skipped through the end or just read the bio but if you're here still with me and you've been watching this video you made this the last lip combo congrats so for the last one it's actually one i discovered i kid you not yesterday yesterday i did a full face of clean makeup for tiktok and i tried out this lip product from a brand that sent me all of their stuff and it was so nice i was also yesterday gonna film a lip combo video for tiktok using it i had other stuff i had to film but i was like i think i'm gonna include this in my lip combo video for youtube because it's just it caught me so off guard the box said lip balm but it has pigment it gives gloss it gives everything so it's by the brand well people you can actually find this in target you guys it's the lip nurture hydrating balm in the color toasty nutmeg first of all nude right off the top it smells like eucalyptus and i love that <laughs> like i'm here for the like, eucalyptus smelling lip products i've never had a lip product smell like a plant before this one i think it's so cute to close out with it gives fall vibes like i said and you guys it just feels so good like because it's a lip balm it definitely gives off balm it's super soft look it's so pretty i don't like pinky either it's more like on the reddish side which caught me by surprise this is gonna be it for the lip combo video you guys you already know if you want to know like details down to everything it's going to be in the bio i think i'm also going to do timestamps for this one i noticed i've never done that before but just as you guys can have lip combo one two three four and five i'm going to just put timestamps. and as always please comment you guys' favorite lip products i always look back at my comments and see what products you guys recommend because most of the time you guys are right so please let me know your favorite lip products if you want to see more videos like this make sure you thumbs up this video comment down below and subscribe for some more leak in your life because i will be posting more i have a super super fun vlog coming it happened like a month ago but i had to get some stuff together so i have like a vlog coming up that's gonna be really exciting make sure you guys are following me on tiktok super super active on there i've been posting every day this week Make sure you're following me on Instagram on all platforms so that you can just know what's going on in my life and see the space a little bit more. But I love you guys so, so, so much and I can't wait to see you guys in the next video. I hope you guys missed me the way I missed you. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!